Alright guys, welcome to Red Dead Part 3. We uh Red Dead Redemption 2 and uh we're back and we I think we're on the part where we have to go do the train or or we do this one mission and we, we go to the train heist. It's it's one of those, so let's get straight into it. I hope you guys are enjoying the series. We're gonna starve to death uh, up here, Mr. Morgan. Let's we're go. Okay. We have a few cans of food and a rabbit. For what? 10, 12 people? When I was in the Navy. I, I do not wish to hear about what you got up to in the Navy, Mr. Pearson. We were stranded at sea for 50 days. And you unfortunately survived. When we ran away from Blackwater, I wasn't able to get supplies in. Well, when government agents are hunting you down, sometimes shopping trips need to be cut short. We'll survive. We always have. And if needs be, we can eat you. You're the fattest. I sent Lenny and Bill hunting, and they found nothing. Well, Lenny's more into book learning than hunting. Bill's a fool. Unless those mountains are full of game that want to read, ain't no wonder they found nothing. Enough of this. We'll go find something. Come on, Arthur. Wait a second. Hold on. Uh, here. You're gonna need something to eat out there. Assorted salted offal. Starving would be preferable. Come on, let's go. You can't go hunting. Look at your hand. I can't stay here listening to you two. Look, if this game in those hills, I'll find it. And you can kill it. You need to rest, Charles. You think this is rest? Come along. Here, you take this. I can't use it, and you'll have to. Oh, you're joking. Use a gun, and we'll scare off every animal for miles around. You're never too old to learn, I imagine. All right, guys, so during the, uh... During cutscenes, I would turn off face cam. I just didn't turn off that kind. Um, I guess we, since we started with the face cam, we could finish with it. At least for this series, we can. Oh. I'm okay. Apart from this hand. If, but Stupid I will mistake. turn off face cam. Y'all don't want it no more. I will take it off. It'll be fine in a day or two. I just can't pull a bow right now. It's nice and cold in my house. I have my uh. Never really got the hang of. Has my little blanket. <laughs> and just uh. Join the game. So, you reckon we're gonna find something to kill? It ain't no Driscoll. <laughs> On some parts, it's kind of dark. Uh, sure. I don't know Pearson if it's. Talking about. I'm gonna now, walk, go back and go on my channel and watch it. We'll head up this way. Find some higher ground. <sighs> Been a wild few days, all right. That ride north from Blackwater, getting stuck in the storm, going out for John. That thing with the old Driscolls? You've had a lot put on you. I wish I could have done more. I didn't mean it like that. Just a lot to think back on. I still don't really know what happened on that boat. Me neither. Well, Javier told me a bit. So, guys, I'm going to try sure to have, uh, keep every video 30 minutes to 40 minutes. I plus I have a long story mode, so this is gonna be a long series. Just bear with me, guys. Hope you enjoy. It. Get some chips, some food, something to drink, and uh, relax while we're on this ride because it's gonna be pretty fun. Uh, let's enjoy. I love how we can do like the cinematic view from like how they had it in GTA when you're riding the cars or the plane. When you're riding the horses, I like that. Hold RB yeah. and tapping S when session to perform. Just move. The winds died down too. That's good. No I'm trying to do it. But if it's too strong, they won't oh yeah, they, yeah, we're definitely gonna do that. <laughs> Plenty of times. You need to stay with me. I'm sorry, I was trying to <laughs> trying to have some fun. Whoa. Hey, 
stop here a second. I see something. Deer been here recently. They're just so good with having like the what footprints in the snow. What I know I said that in a couple past videos, but let's really walk good. it from here. Keep down, move quietly and slowly. Plus, we supposed to be hunting for a deer. Do I gotta follow him or okay? You see the tracks? I think so. Maybe not. Focus. You can use eagle eye to highlight animal traps. Oh, okay, okay. A good clean kill. You can pull back quite hard. You'll kill when it's too much. Whoa. Whoa, okay, so when he's holding it too hard, holding it too long. Now let's try for another. Animals. Attracting animals to attention by call while aiming. This is to give you a chance to clean of a clean to race. So how do I how do I call them? I did not want to do that. I guess we can move now, so <laughs> let me pick up this arrow. Can I not can we not get the deer? Alright. Oh no, that's so wet, but he got some boost, so. Oh he's right there. I didn't see him at first. This might be our only chance for a good meal. Oh, they're running away. No, where are you going? <laughs> I thought it was always cool to uh have hunting animals. Oh no! They didn't die? I thought I shot him in the neck. Well, it's dead now. Okay, let him do it. That that's just a small whistle. I love how the deer just gets rope around him. Come on, put some pepper in your stuff. Oh. Too bad for the horses that's going through this water. Ready to head back when you are. Come on, then. Let's head back. Yeah. Nice work, Arthur. Should be enough meat here to keep us all fed for a few days. You found him. I knew you'd be okay with that bow. It's easier when they ain't shooting back. <laughs> I've seen enough of that. Considering how things were looking at I thought it was always back, cool to do, um, to play like, little cowboy games. <laughs> I always wanted to have like I used to like watch Toy Story and be like I'll have the little Woody the Woody doll the cowboy hat I like it had like a little Halloween out, uh, outfit <laughs> it was always cool you're probably right and even if we do get off here what that still have a big price on our heads most times when I do walk through if I do more walkthroughs I'm gonna be completely lost in every game I play oh. I'm not gonna know what I'm going to be doing. Oh, 
I'm sorry. Get that horse in line, Arthur. You notice how Pearson's had a bottle in his hand ever since we fled Blackwater? We give the camp cook five minutes to grab the essentials and go, and he doesn't even bring a crumb of food. Good that we caught more than one. We've only been up here a few days and have already picked up two more mouths to feed. One more. We ain't feeding Neil Driscoll a damn thing. Except maybe that can of salt and awful Pearson was kind enough to give us. The girl, she has a wild look in her eye. <sighs> of course. She lost her husband, her home, everything she had. So what do we do with her? Well, once we get out of here and we're back on our feet, we'll see. She might have family somewhere. Who knows? Maybe she'll deal with the O'Driscoll I'll just, I'll just hate to be in the, <laughs> well, in the I know code. My money's on in that fight. I He's hate the weak, code. But that's why, that's why I'm, I'm like years. sitting with a blanket right Maybe now, <laughs> playing this game. They get to us. What is it with the O'Driscolls? You ain't dealt with them? I suppose. Hell, we ain't run into them much the last six months. I guess because they've been over this way. Nah. I've heard a lot of talk about him. Watch out. Bear up ahead. Let's see if we can find another way around. Well, he's got a lot of meat on him. We've got enough here. No need to push our luck. He must be real hungry. Stay well back. Spring storms like this are the worst for animals that sleep all winter. I love how the deer's just hanging on. Cut up here, off the trail. Whoa, boy, easy. We ain't ever talked that much, you and me. How long you been with us now? Five, six months? Something like that. Uh, careful. But you didn't expect this. What? Any of this. Blackwater mess. Being up here? Ah. Uh, sooner or later, a job's gonna go wrong. Nature of life. I just thought you might... Yeah, how did they get to the mountains of the code? Like, <laughs> No. I always wanted to know that. No, you could run it alone, no problem. I did that for a long time. I'm done with it. Always wondering if someone's gonna kill you in your sleep. I still wonder that most nights. <laughs> I reckon you're okay. This suits me. Sure, I could fall in with another gang, but Dutch. You know, Dutch is different. Oh yes, Dutch is certainly different. He treats me fair. Most you do. And for a fellow with a black father and an Indian mother, that ain't normally the case. Well, we need you now. More than ever. Good. And how long have you been with these boys? Why ain't you run off? Me? Oh, 20 years, something like that. Since <laughs> I was <a> We're bonding. <laughs> Easy. 20 years? Yeah. Taught me to read. John, too. Taught me a few other things. And Jose. Huh. I'm sure. Dutch saved me. Saved most of us. That's why we need to stick by him through this. He always sees us right. Yeah. How's that new horse? He's all right. He'll do for now. I appreciate you letting me take Taima the other night. She's a strong one. It's been as hard. God, how far away is this? Is, is that it right there? Because we we went pretty far. <laughs> like we went pretty Same far. With Bill and Brown Jack. He's a drunk, miserable bastard, but he loves that horse. <laughs> I hope they all make it. I tried to ride the cow once. 
Fuck me faster than a bull. Won't take nobody but him. I'm gonna hitch time over here. Got some food back, boys! He's not letting me. There we go. Wait, is he gonna is he gonna let me? Oh there we go. Come on, let's get these over to Pearson. Uh, thank you for showing me how to use the boat properly. I only showed you a little. There's a lifetime of practice to master. Well, well, well. Yeah. Just drop it down in here. What a surprise. I right. find a camp rat loitering around in the kitchen. Is that any way to greet an old friend? I feel like we haven't spoken for days. I do my utmost to avoid. He loves me, really. It's his sad way of showing affection. No, it isn't. Now shoot, get lost. Uh, well, see you gents later. See, you got on just fine. Charles is a wonder. Have a drink, boys. You earned it. Jesus, what is that? Maybe rum, sir. It's the only thing. The only thing. <laughs> Keeps you sane, it does. Yeah, oh. seems to have done a treat on you. You go rest that hand, Charles. We'll be fine in a few days. You mind helping me with the skinning, Mr. Morgan? It's easier if we do it together. Do I get to skin you? <coughs> You're always one with the jokes, aren't you? Come on. This really isn't a job for a man with a burnt hand. I'll see you both later. You skin that one, you Our dumped boys. on the floor there. Um. So this is we finally get that skin the first animal. Cause we we killed um, the wolves back there. We couldn't skin them. He does it so fast and easy. Like, is it like this fast in, in real Not life? Bad, Mr. Moore. <laughs> yeah. They always said you were a butcher. You know you could trade these, sell these, pretty much any town. If you're looking to make a legitimate bit of money, of course. Right now, I'm just looking to get off this mountain alive. Well, if you catch anything else, you bring it to me. Sure. Thank you, Mr. Morgan. Heck, Arthur Morgan's first decent bit of hunting after all these years. Yeah, well, we're on the run now. Everyone's got to do their bit to survive. Just make a good stew. Folk need it. It's been a tough few days. <sighs> It's been a bad few weeks, but Dutch being Dutch, he is busy making plans and Dutch being Dutch, those plans involve robbery and dreams. Well, I thought you was reading him his last rites. Now I see you're introducing him to your other passion. I'll mind you to show me some respect, Mr. Morgan. Mind away, Reverend. You're still here, then? I owe you. Yeah. And you'll pay me. For the moment, just rest. Arthur, I think it's time for the train. You want me to come? Of course I do, but look at you. I was always ugly, Dutch. It's just a scratch. Don't lie still, son. Hello, Abigail. Dutch? Jackie. The boy wanted to see you, John. He's seen me now. Or what's left of me. What about you? Guess I was hoping to see a corpse. Bide your time. You'll see plenty of them. You're a rotten man, John Marston. He is an idiot, Abigail. We all know it. Now, railway men. Bill, now you ride ahead and set the charge at the water tower just before the tunnel. Ain't a problem. Why are we doing this? Weather's breaking. We could leave. I, I thought we was lying low. Yeah, come on. What do you want from me, Hosea? I just don't want any more folks to die, Dutch. We're living, Hosea. We're living. Look at me. We're living, even you. But we need money. Everything we have is in Blackwater. You fancy heading back there? No. Listen, Dutch, I ain't trying to undermine you. I just 
I just want to stick to the plan, which was to lie low, then head back out west. Now, suddenly we're about to rob a train. What choice have we got? Leviticus Cornwall's no joke, Dutchie. Well, who is Leviticus Cornwall? You know, he's a big railway magnet, sugar dealer, oil man. Well, how good for him. Sounds like he has more than enough to share. Dutch! Gentlemen, it is time to make something of ourselves. Get your horses ready. We have a train to rob. Everyone ready? All right. Let's go. I love the music. Boys, let's, boys, let's get go. Let's go. And let's rob a train. <laughs> Where we dropping, boys? <laughs> Where we dropping, boys? Simple. <laughs> That's gonna be the title of this video. Part three, where we dropping, boys. So where's the railroad at? So this is all that we discovered. We all went through here. Um, I think the map keeps on getting bigger more than you explore. Okay, gentlemen, listen up. Cause it was smaller you, first. According to the information so kindly provided to us by the O'Driscolls, the train will be coming north from Big Valley. We're gonna pick it off after it crosses the border into the Grizzlies. There's a raised spot there. It's you, your Fortnite squad. Hand. Look how we're all in three by three. You'll keep lookout for any outriders. How's that hand, by the way? I'll be fine. Good. I'll take the driver and engineer, then run point. Lenny and Javier, you two take the front cars, deal with any guards. Arthur and Micah, you head straight for the back. That's what we're after. Mr. Oh, wait, I've been tapping it this whole time. I even don't have to. I just got to steer it. Oh, no, no, no. I think I do got to type it. Because they, they started catching up. Enough! After Bill blows the tracks, we're going to need to move fast. Is everyone clear on what they're doing? Yep, Crystal. Yes, boss. Good. Now, come on. Let's ride. So guys, I try to keep it uh like when cutscenes play, like I said, I try to keep it uh the green um uh, my face and stuff. I keep it off. But thank you for watching, guys. You're all the best audience. I really appreciate all the support that we have since we started this channel. I really appreciate it. He said, out of snow. It, it was still looked like a lot of snow to me. <laughs> Before anyone gets up here after us. Oh, look at you. Where are we boys. dropping, boys? The mountain See? slightly lately. This is what I call a crew. Micah Bell. Charles Smith. Arthur Morgan. Morgan. Javier Escuela. And what about young Lenny here? Always the first man on his horse. Just happy we're back at him, Dutch. You sure you're ready for this, kid? Of course I'm ready. Just stay calm. Keep your eyes sharp. That goes for all of you. No mistakes. Not again. So we do this, then we go back to Blackwater to collect. How many times are you gonna ask the same question, Micah? That's a lot of damn money to leave sitting for too long. It would be crazy to go back there now. The place will be swarming with Pinkertons. We go back when I say we go back, and that's the end of it. Money safe. All right, guys, I hope you are enjoying the series. We're going to end it right here for part three. I hope you enjoy it. We're trying not to keep the videos too long, but uh, there's a lot of stuff in this story, so we'll be right back with another video. So stay tuned, get some food, and I am out.